Hi everyone, I just wanted to make a short video about how to see the feedback for your grades in D2L. In case you didn't know how to do that, I will do that for all Dropbox box assignments. Um, it just makes it easier to grade. It does go through Turnitin, which is a plagiarism checker, um, but it also allows me to um, give you feedback quicker and easier. So, and I'm in a fake student account, which I have for each class so that I can see how the class looks like to a student, which helps uh, both of us, I think. So I will select a course and I will go into my grades. But I see in my grades that I don't see any place to, to view the feedback. But I know that this is a Dropbox assignment, so I will go over to Dropbox. And indeed, I do see that there's a, a grade given and also some feedback. So I'm going to click on the view, which takes me to the feedback screen. If I click on the assignment, it will just take me back into the Dropbox where I can add another document. But I don't want to do that right now. I want to view the feedback. So I hit view. And you can see that there's some feedback down here already. It says, Holly, you did a good job here, but there are a few things missing. But that is not the only feedback. I also um, mark up your paper um, if there are things that I think uh, you need to be aware of. And that is found right here in grade mark. So I'm going to click on grade mark. And this is what it looks like in grade mark. It goes through turn it in, um, which is checking for plagiarism. Um, and you can see that I've made comments. Anytime you see one of these quote icons, I have made comments. So if you click on one, you will see what I've written. Really fake. Um, and then you click on it to get it to close and you open the next one. Where's your title page? Cause that's, that's a frequent comment that I make. Cause you see that this, this is a really bad example of a paper. Obviously it has no name. It has no title page and it's pretty short. Um, so those are how the quotes work. I use this if you've made grammar and spelling mistakes or you've not done your citations correctly, whatever I see in your paper that um, will help you to do better next time. And then you also see that there is another box for the text comment. So if you didn't see it the first time, it will be here as well. So that's pretty much how to see all of the feedback from the Dropbox assignments. And if you have any questions, just email me.